What's up guys, welcome to Android Academy. In this video, I am going to show you how to create this calculator. So I will show you the working first. I have also created this using Eclipse. I uh, will put the links in the description bar below and if you want to know how to install Android Studio then I have made a video on that too which will be uh, the link for that video will also be in the description bar below so this is how it works and in this part this is the first part of the video in this part will create the UI so go to file new and name my calculator or anything here you can select the minimum SDK click next then select blank activity next and finish so as you can see building my uh, it is now building the my calculator application so this is how it will look uh, for the first time and there will be a string which uh, and its value will be hello world so just select it and delete it and go to text this is the relative layout uh, we want linear layout so make it linear layout and go to the design tab again now as you can see this is the horizontal layout we want vertical linear layout so again go to text and write android dot, uh, colon orientation is equal to um, vertical in double quotes it should be up here so again go to design now as you can see in the component tree it is linear layout vertical now first get a medium text double click and text enter first number then for id label num1 l num1 l means label i prefer naming it like that so that i remember the labels names now get a text field and id is tf num1 that is text field num1 again a median text medium text enter second number id is l num2 now get one more plain text text field double click text will be blank tf num2 text field num2 now we need a large text for our result so get it here drag it mm. okay plain text is a small one so get large text double click and click on that dots new resource new string value we'll name it empty string because the value will be empty and resource value will be nothing blank then double click and set the id to label l answer or result anything you want just remember the names and if you don't remember it you can see it in the component tree then we need four buttons for our four operations get small button double click plus and d add then get three more buttons and repeat the same thing
minus and b subtract that is b sub two more buttons for multiplication and division now select first button and here in properties find on click here is the on click property it, it is blank so write on button click you can write anything here then do the same thing for rest of the buttons on button click So whatever you write here will be used in the java file which will be the name of the method. So this is the basic layout of, of our calculator application. In the next video I'll show you how to create the java file and how to link these uh, layout elements to our java elements. So this is it for today. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more Android application developing videos. Thank you so much for watching guys. Bye.